this industry expert joined NAFA to learn about the fleet business and quickly got his CAFM certification. He credits his involvement and certification in landing a fleet director's position, and he's been active in NAFA ever since. You know, I joined NAFA in uh, 1996, uh, and it was really in an effort to learn more about fleet. I was in the maintenance side of, of at the university, and my director was retiring. So I joined NAFA to learn more about fleet. Uh, at my first conference, I saw the uh, graduates of the CAFM program and decided I would pursue that. Uh, I did pursue it, and I got my CAFM in 1997. In 1997 is when my predecessor retired, and I really uh, believe that my CAFM and my activeness with NAFA at that point is what got me the director position. There were three people that applied for the position. Two of them were actually had been with the university for 20 and 25 years, and I had only been there for less than seven. So I, I was able to, through my connections with NAFA, learn about the fleet industry, learn about what I needed to do with the operation. Uh, once I did get that position, I moved on to learn more and more about the fleet and, fleet and what I needed to do to improve our fleet at the university and utilized a lot of the educational opportunities to uh, improve our fleet as well, as well as products that I had purchased. Uh, we were in the process of, in 1999, we had a Y2K issue, so we had to purchase a new fleet software system. I was able to uh, utilize NAFA to find the vendors that I needed and to, uh, to actually reach out and, uh, and put a, an RFP out there and find a vendor that I've been in great relationships with ever since then and actually was a part of their, uh, their pilot program for their automated motor pool system. 